Welcome back friends to Gamer SBR. The Nintendo Switch is continuing to do well in the market since it was released. This console hybrid allows players to take their gaming on the go or enjoy docked and played at home. You're going to see plenty of new exciting exclusive in 2020 and if you're looking to keep track of some of the most anticipated titles for Nintendo Switch in 2020 then you came to the right place. We post videos every week so don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified whenever a video goes public. Number 1. Gods and Monsters We only got a small trailer but this is from the same development team that previously worked on Assassin's Creed Odyssey. For now, it looks like the development team wanted to stick with the deep lore of geek mythology, with an open world for players to explore. All we have is a cinematic trailer to the game, so we haven't to wait until some gameplay footage is released into the public in order to see just how the mechanics will handle. Number 2. Doom Eternal Originally set to come out this November, Doom Eternal has been delayed to March 2020. ID Software and publisher Bethesda Softworks announced a delay on Twitter. The game is a follow-up to 2016's Doom, taking place after an unknown amount of time and centering on the Doom Slayer's return to Earth to save the human race. Google originally announced that Doom Eternal would come to Stadia in 2019, joining a lineup of other highly anticipated games such as Cyberpunk 2077 and Watch Dogs Legion. Number 3. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Sequel it was quite a surprise to see that Nintendo was ready to pump up another Zelda title after The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild that released in 2017, and it received critical acclaim for being not only an excellent Zelda title to the series, but an outstanding open world title. During E3 2019, Nintendo unveiled to the world that a sequel to the title was in development. In the trailer we see both Link and Zelda go into an underground chamber where a new enemy seems to have awoken. Number 4. Little Nightmares 2 If you enjoyed Treasury Studios' Little Nightmare, then you may have been holding out hope that a sequel would be in works. The sequel to the platformer is Inbound, which will be taking on the role of a new child named Mono. The game will take place after Six had escaped the mall, new series of hostile words and obstacles are in your way of freedom. You can likely expect plenty of new hostile levels to progress through and it seems that players will be able to wield some items in the level, likely to go against the horrifying enemies of the game world. Number 5. Devil's Hunt Demon Hunters Rejoice Devil's Hunt, a bombastic punch em up from 1C Entertainment and Loyupi Games, is making its way to the Nintendo Switch. The new coincides with the announcement of a delay of PS4 and Xbox One versions with all three now set for release in the first quarter of 2020. Based on the novel Equilibrium by Paul Leniak, Devil's Hunt is a third-person action game in which players will fight their way through hell. Number 6. Remothered – Broken Porcelain Broken Porcelain brings an abundance of welcome changes to the series, introducing new gameplay and storytelling elements that breathe new life into the characters, and an unprecedented level of immersion in the hunting adventure perfect for both new and returning fans to the series. The truth buried in the Ashman Inn will not be discovered easily. Its many mysteries are intertwined and guarded by the looming threat of the stalkers, powerful hunters trapped in time and the confines of its walls. Number 7. My Hero Wants Justice 2 Bandai Namco has announced My Hero Wants Justice 2 for Switch. The sequel will adopt the battle system of his predecessor, while adding a significant amount of new playable characters, including new characters that appear in the fourth season of the TV anime. The first new playable character confirmed is Kai Chisaki, whose quirk is called Overhaul. In addition to character-specific actions, quirk abilities are also being significantly upgraded. Number 8. Darksiders Genesis The Darksiders series is getting a new spin-off entry called Darksiders Genesis, a Diablo-style action role-playing game from developer Airship Syndicate, the studio behind Night Chasers Night War. Darksiders Genesis will star a brand new horseman named Strife and feature fast-paced dungeon crawling action. In the game's first teaser trailer, we see Strife fighting alongside War from the original Darksiders, battling demons with guns, blades and magic spells, and harvesting loot in action that looks highly reminiscent of Diablo 3. Number 9. Metroid Prime 4 
Nintendo has rebooted Metroid Prime 4 and placed series developer Retro Studios in charge of the title's ongoing development. It's been 10 years since we joined Samus for a round of arm cannon blasting. It's hard to say when development is starting over and nothing has been revealed or even hinted at so far. What we can do is speculate off of the back of Metroid Prime 3, Corruption. Although that still doesn't really give us much to go on. Number 10. No More Heroes 3 no More Heroes 3 were released exclusively on the Nintendo Switch in 2020. Suda51 did not reveal any exact release date. Little is known about the story of the No More Heroes 3. We know it involves an alien invasion that Travis Touchdown is the only one who can stop it. Suda51 revealed No More Heroes 3 is a continuation of all the games. Set two years after Travis strikes again, he teased the stakes for Travis have become far more dire, as Travis is saving the world now instead of saving his own hide. 11. Trials of Mana The original Mana games have aged pretty well, which was previously only available in Japan as Saikin Densetsu. But the remake not only looks better visually, not to this pixel art, but seems to have updated the game's combat and other systems considerably. Here's hoping they keep the old fast travel system, which is basically just shooting yourself into the stratosphere using a supercharged slinky. 12. Bayonetta 3 Platinum Games are developing the game exclusively for Nintendo Switch. If you still haven't had the honor of being a first-time Bayonetta player, you should first know that Platinum Games' franchise is arguably the best action experience of its kind since the glory days of the Devil May Cry series. The second game in the series was released exclusively for Wii in 2014. It was one of the most critically acclaimed games for the year and is widely considered and is widely considered to be among the first action titles ever made. Can Platinum do it again? 13. LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga Is the Star Wars game you've been waiting for? It's not a release with more content, it's not even a remaster. Instead, LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga is an entirely new game that has been redesigned from the ground up to give players the ultimate Star Wars experience in LEGO form. This has been accomplished through the use of all new game engine, the implementation of an open world sandbox and a total revamp of the combat system. 14. Minecraft Dungeons There is no particular reason Minecraft Dungeons needs to be a Minecraft game. Its dungeon crawling gameplay could fit any fantasy setting. Its enemies could be baddies from any monster hack and slash. There's no mining or crafting, and yet the Minecraft theme makes a lot of sense. It's a friendly aesthetic for a different genre. Its enemies are instantly recognizable and while you won't spend your time knocking down any walls, there's plenty of characters building to get to grips with. 15. Ninjala Ninjala is a morphing ninja gum action game that allows players to blow bubble gum to craft weapons and use the inconventional fighting method ninjutsu. Adapting to different landscapes, players must be light and fast reflexes and super parkour mechanics to combat and counter their opponents. The game brings new era to the world of ninjas through online battle against each other. Players can take the game in 8 player battle royale, a free for all ninja conquest. 16. The Last Night The Last Night immerses you in the everyday life of Charlie, a second-class citizen living in a city, brimming with augmentation and citizens living a gamified existence, none of which Charlie can experience himself due to a childhood accident. Pathetic and disheartened by the seemingly pointless war around him, Charlie is presented with an opportunity to take matters into its own hands. But at what risk? 17. Empire of Sin The strategy game from Romero Games and Paradox Interactive puts you at the heart of the ruthless criminal underworld of the 1920s Prohibition era Chicago. It's up to you to hustle charm and intimidate your way to the top of the pile and do whatever it takes to stay there. This character-driven noir-inspired game puts players smack dab in the glitz and glamour of the Roaring Twenties, all while walking behind the scenes under belly of organized crime. 18. Haven Thankfully, the first gameplay trailer for Haven has been revealed, offering a taste of what can be expected. The title itself is about you and Kai, a couple who escaped to an alien world to be together and must now survive the various trials of tribulations. Creative director Emmerich Thua says that it's a very accessible RPG, a relaxing game and purposefully a very different experience from Fury. 19. 
Circuit Superstars. Circuit Superstars is a top-down physics-driven racing game for PC and consoles. It combines arcade-style racing with more realistic tactical driving physics, which brings together a whole range of styles and eras of motorsports, from 60s-inspired single-seaters to modern GTS. Circuit Superstars will feature vehicle and tracks from various motorsports eras. Number 20. Digimon Survive A story of survival in a strange new world. Celebrating the 20th anniversary of Digimon anime, Digimon Survive presents a brand new adventure set in a mysterious world with characters designed by Yuichi Ikumo and music by the much acclaimed Tomoki Miyoshi. Digimon Survive sees a brand new group of teenagers, led by Takuma, get lost in a school camping trip, finding them transported to a strange new world of monsters and danger as they fight their way back home through an animated world of difficult decisions and deadly battles players' choices throughout the game will impact the evolution of their monsters' allies. And the final ending. Battles in the game are fought in 2D in more classic SRPG style. 